quickly let me check my audio while I get my chat up. Get that fixed. Get that good. And this. The mic level. And everything seems to be good. Alright. What up, though, guys? Welcome back to Assassin's Creed Origins. I apologize for the very, very late start tonight. Um, I do intend to start trying to move things back a little bit, starting about two, well, one and a half to two hours earlier as, like, a regular thing. It is Halloween, though, for me, at least. Um, and, dear God, holy shit, am I tired. <laughs> uh, I apologize if I'm a little bit slow with the commentary, or if I'm not paying as much attention to the chat as I normally would. Or if I'm just like, I'm getting hit and stupid shit's happening. But I did want to bring you guys an episode. I did want to play some games. I didn't just want to go right back to goddamn bed. Because I may as well be productive with my nights. You know? Anyways. Like I said, I apologize greatly for the really late ass start. And welcome back guys. And yeah. So today we should be figuring out... I'm not figuring out who Cleopatra is, because we know who she is, but we should get to a, a, like a chance to actually see her today. Um, hmm. Slight increase to melee damage. What does it use? Right, and I was saving that for something else, wasn't I? Yep, breastplate. So, we need to find some regular pelt. We also need to continue our quest line, and we for sure need to do the nomad mission today. Bring it in. What up, Doe Lone Wolf? Welcome back to the stream and chat, sir. How's it going for you today? Sorry about the late start. A little bit tired. Took my, uh... Took my sweet fucking time actually waking up and getting ready to stream. Convincing myself not to go back to sleep. Or at least my body. God damn, this camel is just weird to ride. His gallop is just like, it's strange. I don't know. It doesn't feel quite right. Oh well. Soon I'll be swapping back to a horse, I think. Three humped camel? Uh, no idea, actually. I think I've heard this one like a long, long, long ass time ago, but I can't remember the answer for the life of me. Move, move. Hold on. Pregnant. <laughs> oh, that's well, that's a different answer than I remember. If the answer was the same, or similar, or whatever. Question. The villager has been taken. Don't worry, I have the perfect payment in mind for you. Hmm. Missing worker. Where am I going? 930 meters this way. Don't worry, I have the perfect payment for you. Well, that's actually really encouraging. I gotta say, though, that kid's awesome. He fucking constantly, like, well, not constantly, but every day you just go get a mission from him, he gives you some pretty crazy shit. I think being that I'm streaming the game is gonna help me out even more, too, because it means that I'm probably going to be able to do more of those quests in a shorter in-game period of time, if you get what I mean. Mm. Bring up the black arrow. Come on, Jose. Supposedly fast. And nimble. According to the description. So... Oh yeah, no, it's getting up to speed pretty fucking good there. Not bad at all. Definitely think it's faster than my, like, battle horse thing. And I mean, hey, you know what? Don't get me wrong. Staring down danger and maybe even hitting some guys that are trying to fuck with me is awesome. But, I mean, I'm riding this not for the combat capabilities of it. It's not a goddamn tank or an APC. I'm riding this to get somewhere. So if it goes faster, I'm happy. Wildstar? What's Wildstar? And congrats, bro. Level 50 is... Well, it seems... Depends on the game, I guess. Some games, level 50 is a fucking nightmare to get to. So yeah, no, congrats, man. 
no. There we go. Instant. Wait, is there more shit here? Out of curiosity. See if I can't find everybody that's around. They're all looking like they're civvies. Whoa. Stick you over here. Hey. See, I give them props for making them more curious. I give them props for making them a little bit more aggressive and able to see you in the grass when they get close enough. But I don't really, like, they still do some pretty stupid shit like that. Where you can walk into some grass and they're like, hey, I didn't see him leave that. And then they walk up and get stabbed in the face. Now, I'm not hey, saying no. it's the worst thing in the world. It sometimes can be very, very nice to just be able to walk in and fuck shit up. But it can also be kind of nice when the enemies are actually useful. And a pain in the ass. Like, it's, yeah, it's an MMO, 50 is the max level, nice. So how god mode does that make you then? Can you just basically tank like five or six people at once if they're, you know, five, ten levels lower? I got to imagine the scaling is pretty intense if level 50 is the last. What's up, bud? There we go. Give it a little scan pulse, see if there's anything nice and juicy nearby. I'm not gonna bother with the little info scroll thing. It's never anything good or useful. Ah, uh, yeah, no, definitely. This is the man Reda spoke of. Dead. I'm not too surprised, and I'm sorry about that, Lone Wolf. The fact that I'm streaming so goddamn late means that there might not be as many people on, and yeah. Yeah. It's not the best idea to stream right now. Consistency is key. Plus, for some of us, like me, it is Halloween night. For some people, that was last night. For some of us, it's tonight. So that divides the parties up a little bit. Uh, I kind of want to go check out that spot up ahead. But I should probably just take this poor bastard home. Wait, is this all sealed in? Can I not get... Ah, oh, there we go. Whoa! Ambush! Oh shit, oh shit, wrong turn at Albuquerque. Wrong turn at Albuquerque. That's not good. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, that was sketch bag. Get the fuck out of there. I'm rescuing him. <clears throat> Alright, follow the road, horsey. Go, go, go. Hey, what up, Doe Chairman? What? Uh, welcome back to the stream and chat, sir. How's it going? We only started a couple of minutes ago, so the notifications weren't too bad today unless it just didn't send you one at all. Well, fair enough. I mean, I am usually streaming at this point in time. I just, by this point in time, I'm just about done one and moving on to the next, so. What? Alright, so. Just about back. Then we'll get something for our troubles. Some type of legendary loot, hopefully. Huh? 
Wait, did we go? We did go somewhere new, didn't we? Ah, I've never actually been here before. Huh. Neato. Might end up uh, kind of chilling around here. No, 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 never mind. We need to go see Cleopatra. I want to see what she looks like I in this game. Ah, fair enough. Alright. May he find peace in the door, Since you found him, see you people's can have the weapon blade. I got for him special. Powerful weapon originating from the Mediterranean Raider tribes. It carries a faint tang of the sea. Oh, it looks pretty sick. It's level 17. Not bad at all. Nice, dude. So, can you... Here. I'll leave this with you. Take care of him. All right. The Ostrich, an abuse of power. Plus a whole bunch of other quests. Holy fuck. What's this? Ptolemy's, Ptolemy's Fist? What? Half Horn. Huh, are these like bandit camps then? It's gotta be like bandit camps or something. Interesting. Huh. Also, gotta say, quests fucking everywhere in this game. All over the goddamn place. Bases to take over. Like, actually 100%ing this game would take... I don't even know how long. A while. And, like, probably six to eight hours a day for two months. I wouldn't even be surprised. Alright, let's check out the quests. Also, let's check out the gear, actually. Let's see that new sword we got. Sea People's Blade. 167. Damn. What's our current one at? 157. Let's get that thing going for now. Hey you! Stop! See how it looks. Ah, it's not bad. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. Wouldn't mind having like one of those giant ass great blades that I always get hit with. Alright, that's right. Quests. Start working on our taste of her sting. Hmm. More clues. Bayek seeks Apollodorus in order to meet the exiled Queen of the Nile. That's the one we're looking for right fucking there. Where are we going? A long ways away. Probably gonna just want to fast travel. Yeah. Yeah, we're just gonna want to fast travel. Also, actually, let's just fast travel to here. We'll do another one of these tournament race things, because I think that'll be kind of entertaining and fun to do. And then we will uh, hop on our horse and ride over to Apollomaeus and work on getting to meet the queen and learning more about her dickbag pharaoh. Brother thing, family. I'm pretty sure it was family, didn't they say? Well, my phone's buzzed, so I dropped everything around here as fast as I can. <laughs> awesome, man. Well, I appreciate the dedication there, Lone Wolf. Demolition Derby, fuck yeah. Remesa's Divine Justice, a race honoring the great ancestor. Can you earn Remesa's favor? I don't know if I'm going to win her favor, because I'm probably going to try and wreck everybody, but I'll win. <laughs> or at least I'll attempt to gonna be rather fun beat that drum sir beat that drum remesses divine justice Oh, what 
up though, bitch. Charge, charge. Motherfucker, he is still right on my ass. There we go. Go, 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 go. Still hot on my ass. Motherfucker. You want to take the outside? Be my guest. That was bad. That was bad. Damn it. Lost the end Whoa. Oh, it looked like he didn't even have his fucking carriage attached. That was bad, though. Oh! Oh! Come on, yeah! Fuck yeah. We need a we need Euro beat in this minigame. Fuck yeah, if we had good goddamn music, it would make it so much better. Alright. Two more, I think. Should only be two, right? Pretty sure. I wonder just how big these goddamn things get. Hit the apex, Kush. Hit the apex. It's hard to do in a horse-drawn carriage with this wide of a front end. I'm not used to it. Much easier to do in a Hachiroku. Somebody got wrecked. Final lap. Gotta say, the fuckers are starting to get a little bit violent with me. Still one will be in drug by well, okay, we still got second while being drugged behind the goddamn thing, I'll take it. <laughs> Is the carriage front wheel drive or uh It'd be front wheel drive, technically. Front hoof drive. Your ass in slides. What have I done? Created such a competitive fucking setup. Everybody's ramming everybody and shit now. No mercy. Fucking drove that guy off though. Come on. 
on, keep going. Push, push, push. Oh, that was pretty good. Three. I thought we were already on the last lap. I miscalculated. Not entirely though. Oh. Oh. I'm on low health though. Motherfucker, get off my ass. Go, go, go. No! What? Right at the fucking finish line. What a cuntbag piece of shit. The winner has vanquished all other racers. Event completed? Did I win? Nope. Motherfucker. I'm gonna win this thing. What up, though? Annabeth, welcome back. I actually don't mind this part of things. It's not necessary to complete it. It's just a mini game that you can choose to play. Has nothing to do with the storyline in any way. Well, no, not even. Like, I mean, the side quest doesn't really... You don't have to race it. I just kind of like it. It's a good way to make a little bit of extra money, too. And I'll also state that I haven't really seen a racing mini game like this in anything in a while. I've seen mini games and things, but not really this game. Sorry, this mini game. Come on, horsies. Come on, horses. <clears throat> Very curious, too, that, um... You, you do have, like, custom chariots and shit that you can get later if you get the skill unlocked. You can buy your own chariot. My big curiosity thing is, can I bring my own personal custom chariot in with me? Because I think that would be one of the neatest things. And it would give you a huge edge if you got yourself, like, a legendary fucking crazy-ass set of horses that were all about speed for this drone thing. I don't know if it'll actually let you do that. I'm just saying, it's gonna be really cool if it does, and it's gonna give me a huge advantage. And I really, like I said, I don't mind this one. Welcome back. And yeah, it's not something that I have to do, it's something that I'm choosing to do. I don't mind it having a racing game aspect to it. And the chariots at least make sense.
Oh, chuck that guy out into the woods. What the fuck? Come on. Wow. OP. Why does it never do that to them when I ram them? <laughs> oh, that sucks. probably gonna have to try and reset this race. Can I reset the race? Nope. That blows. Motherfucker. Hope you get a lot of money for this. Why? I don't... I, I don't know. I don't really see why you guys see it as so bad. And like I said, I chose to do this. I really don't care if I get money. I just enjoy the horse racing. It's fun. It's a nice little challenge. You get to fuck your opponents up. I don't know. You guys might be hating on it, but I'm quite enjoying myself. It's a little bit of a bitch. It's certainly difficult to get the hang of. But, uh, yeah. It's fun. I'm enjoying myself. Bam! Back in. Come on. What up, though, Fig Jam? Welcome back, bro. How's it going for you today? Oh, yeah. Fuck yeah. <sighs> I'm not doing another one. Don't worry, guys. I just want to see how many are left, too. Good times. I'm curious what I get if I complete the last tournament. I think the last tournament will give you something really good for loot. You need to get blades on your axles. I don't think that's a possibility. I think that'd be excellent. It would be. It would be a lot fucking better. But I really don't think that's something that I'm going to get to do. 
Here's the other thing. Large shields, large lessons. All right. Does that mean I'm like my thing is, can I possibly and I mean possibly get myself a tower shield for my own character? Cuz seriously, I hate this whole like blocks a tiny little portion of himself. It sucks. It's not enough. <clears throat> I like to be able to protect my legs. You know, the things that keep me alive by making me move around and walk and and jump and everything. Like, you lose your legs, you get shot in the leg in this time period. You're pretty much fucked. It is quite a nice blade, it seems. It's interesting. It's very interesting. Blade of the Sea People. Hmm. Alright. Off to go see Canopus and all them we go. Demosthes at Canopus Harbor. Right. And then after we rescue Demosthes, he should give us some intel about Cleopatra, if not take us to her to talk to her. There should be a decent amount of mutual trust then. It's weird that it slows down in town. Like, is there a horse speed limit? Because it's kind of retarded. Gotcha. Stay here, good horse. Alright. I'm just gonna sit here, man. I'm just chilling. Don't worry about it. Damn. Decent amount of people around here. Is that everybody? Pretty much. Be seen in this area. Come on down, bro. Hey, what? There we go. There's one. Something is close. I Come on, swear. brother. There we go. Two down. All right. I have to hmm. sleep in my own filth in here. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna take the slightly longer route. <laughs> Try to cover all my bases, basically. Still safe. Oh, actually, that kind of helps. He's interested. Come on down and investigate, sir. That seemed really fishy, didn't it? Couldn't, couldn't possibly know what's gonna happen. Huh. Except you're gonna get stabbed in the face and stuffed in a bush. That's what's gonna happen. What? Come on, investigate, sir. Think you're clever? Damn. He's not interested. Wow, and that guy moved. Motherfucker. Hmm. 
I mean, way to make my job a little bit easier. Good job noticing your two dead buddies in the grass. Oh, that's great. Let's just mark this guy. What's up, bud? Right in the side of the head. This feels, I gotta say, it feels more like an Assassin's Creed game now. Not full, not full, but it does feel a little bit more sneaky, assassin-y, stab people in the side of the head thing. Like I'm getting a little bit more of the vibe, which is nice. That's what I'm looking for. Hey, how much got you? Ah! Oh, oh! Didn't last long at all. Here you go, sir. Get me out of here. I ain't gotta do shit. Get yourself out of here. Thank you. It was very unpleasant. Fucking in expectationalism. You have killed them all. Bastards. They deserve to die. Yep. Let's Get go. Get me to a safe place. Then we will talk. What the hell are you doing, man? <laughs> Keep going, dude. Do not look back. Do not look back. It's actually working out really, really well. He runs just fast enough for me to be able to, like, walk backwards with my bow drawn. Make sure nobody's coming at us. That worked out great, actually. Gotta say, that was, that was good. That was good. Let me catch up on the chat here. Pirate Captain Flag. What up, Doe Ninja Kiwi? Welcome back to the stream and chat. And, yes, I did get your message about the heavy blunt swing. I've actually done that quite a few times in here already. Uh, can't wait to play this game. Yeah, no, it's very, very good. I will admit, you're right, Annabeth, the mine outfit looked horrible. It did. Are you by chance eating mayonnaise? Huh? Huh? Oh, oh, I see, I see. Never mind. What up, though, Florin Constantine? Welcome to the stream and chat. How's it going for you today, sir? Brotherhood, in pretty, I'm pretty sure. What up, Florin? Cool, I watched the Etsy of Death. I want to play this game. Yeah, no, it's, it's, uh, it's interesting. I will point that out. It is very interesting. It doesn't feel entirely like an Assassin's Creed game. It's a step in a different direction. It's not the Give worst the direction scroll. ever. I hope that scroll. they kind of I do not have any still have Your some Assassin's Creed it. games that come out I that feel ship. more like an Assassin's Creed game, but it's fine. Where is the ship? At the bottom of the lake. They sank it. Now, oh, for fuck's sake. Very well. I will get it. Apollodorus is waiting for you at the lighthouse. I will tell him to find you near the sunken ship. Great. God damn it. What is it with, like, nobody being able to swim and hold their breath underwater but us? Stop, you shit! Stop, you shit. Well, too bad. Peace out. What's on this ship, anyways? Senu not available. What? So you're telling me I can... There we go. I was gonna say, you're telling me that I can use Senu... To go ahead and do all types of silly shit, but I can't do that one. Actually, there we go. Left, there we go. Really curious what the vase is. Like, I've seen them a couple of times. Do I shoot them? Do I? It is an oil vase, isn't it? Yup. 
And then if you were to light that on fire, yeah, you could fuck people up pretty good. Is that a piece of wood? Oh, I think it's a piece of the jar, actually. Or some other floating wreckage. Oh, cool, you can go straight into a dive. I just held the circle button. He didn't even try to swim back up and then dive down. He just went straight into it. That was nice. I like that one. That precious <coughs> scroll. That precious Heck. scroll. Try athlete trophy earned. Whoops. Come on, there we go. Like, oh man, you would think the vegetables and fruits and shit like that, like this game just makes it seem like it's plentiful and it's everywhere and it's, Egypt is just basically drowning in food and I don't really feel like that was the case. Give the scroll to Apollodus. Oh, he decided to go over there. Turn. Paddle. Paddle like a motherfucker. Grab some of that wind. What up, though, Shams YT? And that does that. Nice. Yeah, no, sorry, that's, uh, no. Uh, um, because Annabeth, I've mentioned it before, but that is one thing, one thing that I do not tolerate, period, end of story with my chat. Do not come in here and promote your own shit. That is an insta-ban. It's one thing to be a regular and come in and be like, hey, you know, I did this or I did that. It's another thing to come in and be like, hey, did you see that video that this person put out? For you to take your time to come in here and say, hey, check out my stuff to everybody in here is a complete lack of respect. It's, it, I just, that's one thing that I absolutely do not tolerate. Whether he knows the rules or not, it is, it is beyond fucking rude. And yeah, that's not the type of people that I'd like in the chat. Anyways. Yeah. Your precious papyrus. Well done, by I've I've had that. That's I how I've done things pretty much since the Someone beginning. I may be able to trust. And I gotta say, the I don't think there's the there's a chat around where they encourage you to come in and do that, unless side. they're trying to just do the sub she for sub thing. To you for but the yeah. Communication secret. She's at my estate. We're headed there now. Good times. How does Aya fit into all this? Her cousin Thanos informed me that she was a driven woman stalking... I'll also play. point out, too, a ban so doesn't mean they I can't view the videos. A ban simply play. means they can't use the chat. Aya was successful. I stepped in to protect her. We are grateful. And we are grateful that you have eliminated Eudorus. He was an odious individual. I should tell you that in addition to Eudorus, Put an end to the Philaketai of Alexandria, Gennadios. Gennadios? I am very glad he is dead. But it will cause serious problems for you. The Philakis oh? are a tightly bound group. And murderers. They will certainly come after you. Then I will hunt so them down. It. Can I ask why you wanted Eudorus dead? As you know, Cleopatra's brother, Ptolemy, is too young and pliable to be a strong leader. We believe Eudorus was the force behind Ptolemy, responsible for so many of Egypt's current ills. 
Here we are. The villa is up ahead. Yes, yes, it is. Do we get to meet Cleopatra now? I really hope we get to meet Cleopatra now. I know, man. That's the thing. That's it. Right there. Lone Wolf, you nailed it, sir. And yeah, I mean, that's the, that's the biggest thing with the sub for sub thing. If somebody's trying to build their own channel and trying to, like, you know, put in a lot of work on their own shit and shit like that and going through to other people's channels instead of putting in the work to try and get them to sub so that their sub co count goes out, it doesn't really matter if your sub count is up if you don't have any views. I would much rather have a smaller sub count in a tight-knit community that I trust and I like to talk to and, you know, that I enjoy doing this with than have 2,000 subs that I never see because they don't give a shit. Can we move a little faster there, Apollodorus? The high society. I'm pleased that Aya is bringing some sober substance to Cleopatra's social circle. She is an extraordinary woman, your wife. I know. I don't really know if you can call her I some, like, normal shit, though. Before she likes I to kill people. All secrets. Cleopatra must meet and approve of you. Good. She can be particular. Let me give you some advice. When you approach the queen, bend your knee in deference. Speak only in reply. Yours is not to question, but to answer. Uh. Do not be distracted by the festivities. She has a large entourage, and they like to amuse themselves. Sometimes to excess. Speak clearly, in measured tones, and above all, do not meet her gaze. See, that's something Ready? that's just, like, so different around the wait. world. Some fucking cultures are just like, hey, you have to look me in the eye. Some cultures are like, you better not look me in the eye. Alright, Wolf will see you in a few, bro. <laughs> Catch me! Catch me! Come here, both of you! Yes. She caught me with her husband. The sensation is most delightful. This way. She doesn't hold the ground. Bees. Where is my opium puppy? I will sleep with anyone as long as they agree to be executed in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> wow. He was well satisfied That's with his That's fucked bargain. up. Who is this toothsome fellow? In Mehoto et Nebsheve. My queen, this is, uh... Well? It is a generous offer. But I've already pledged my life to this woman. Aya, you have chosen well. Come, we have much to discuss. Celebrate, my friends! She's a crazy bitch. You were meant to I'll be. fuck anybody as long as they're prepared to die in the morning. That is, like, whoa. Damn, dark. Ah, Pasharemta. Meet Aya and Bayek. They put an early end to Eudoros. Delightful. You are joining our efforts, then. We do not know what your efforts are. Eudorus nope. is a member of the Order of Ancients. They are responsible for my exile. The Order they tore of me Ancients, from my huh? throne. And why should I care about them? Well, the snake has many heads. Those heads make up the Order. The snake is the man who killed my son. It is not so simple. What are they talking about? It's an about? organization, isn't know. it? They must know something. The Order of Ancients seeks to control all Egypt. Ptolemy is but their puppet. Hmm. We have informants in each region. They have been unable to touch the order. Across Egypt, mysterious forces work against us. For instance, here, in the Nile Delta, oh? the endless sands swallow up whole villages. Yet, a malignant human force moves with them. That force is one of the order of ancients, called the Scarab. And over here, in most sacred Giza, 
A shadowy figure called a hyena controls all that occurs. What the fuck? What is certain is that Giza is the land of death and loss. And then there's Memphis. All is cast in my land. Even the sacred Apis bull himself. What One hot lizard fuck? has worked a sort of diabolical power. I wonder so if they have items. Is the order of ancients. Yes. Eudorus was known as the Hippo. You are right, my love. He was not the last one. All of these are. When the order wants something, as in Siwa, it does not hesitate to crush all in its path. For I Siwa, feel like you're kind of the same way there, though, Cleopatra. It is the most oppressed region in all of Egypt. Where the crocodile wields cruel power, the denizens live in constant fear. That's boar. That is the fate that awaits all Egypt. If we fail to There's gotta be the more than what they've mentioned so far. There's too many regions. We need decisive action. It is time for assassinations. Assassinations, huh? We still have not found the man who killed him. Our son shed will weep with joy when we clear the map of those figures. Will it though? Will it really? You are my Magi now. Protector of the true Pharaoh of Egypt. Oh, we got a fancy ass badge. Isn't that special? So it shall be. Tonight, we drink. Celebrate. Make love. Tomorrow. We start killing people again. Well, hey, at least hers is cooler. What up, Doe San? Welcome to the stream and chat, sir. I try not to talk over the cutscenes too much if they're very informative, so I'm sorry it took a while to get there, but you know. What? Let me catch up on the chat here and see what the hell is going off of this. Uh-huh. Medjai. Warrior like, yeah. The weasel. Let's go see what the hell this guy wants. How's it going, sir? You, Neb, are young and your legs are strong. Perfect for my needs. Ah, uh, that's not the way you come on to a dude, dude. But she is so unreliable. Probably batting her eyes at the master of arts. If I see her. Never mind, Ken. I want my what? You don't even care about the chick. That's great. All news is important to us these days. All right, Stuart. I will see what I can do. I'm king of Pluto. Well, I mean, king of a moon is still king of a moon, I guess. Basically an asteroid at this point in time, but you know. Hungry River is another side quest we can grab while on the way. Let's quickly check our quest and make sure this one isn't just like, never mind, it's right fucking here. Where is it? Less than 100 meters that way, we can definitely get this shit done right now. <laughs> oh, God. Fuck. Fucking sneezing, man, I tell ya. Goddamn allergies. What does upset you? Hmm? The hell? An ill omen. How did that charcoal get spilled? Oh. 
What the fuck? Blood. Still fresh. Blood, blood everywhere. The railing broke. And someone went over it. Watch us just land on a body. Lot of blood. Where's the body? That's kind of what I want to know. Over here? Uh, this is where you are hidden. I Pull this guy you. out. Lady out. I will take you back to for the rights. Poor Ruya. If you had only known how to make such a living. What did you get yourself into? Beasts, no doubt. The faces of men prey on the weak and powerless. We cannot simply show our bellies to the jackals that plague our land. Damn, she met with not a good end. Not a good end at all. By the gods. Ruya. What happened? She was thrown to her death from the pigeon tower. <laughs> Your letter. Mm. Why was she killed? That's a question for you to figure out. The badge worn by Dimnos, our master of arms. Why did she have it? I will find out soon enough. Motherfucker. Of course there's more to the question. More to the puzzle. Ooh. Poor girl. May you walk in the field of peace. Hey, bud. Why'd Dimnos. you chuck the bitch off? I'm looking for Ruya. Why would I know where that peasant is? Damn. He's a cranky bitch. Seems like we're gonna have a problem with you already, sir. Perhaps I have a funny feeling this might not end bad. Shit. Or not end well, sorry. Well, she was just an Egyptian dog. No matter. Why did you do it? Truth? I didn't mean to kill her. Only teach her a lesson for her insolence. She refused to read a letter for me. Wow! You must confess to Pelias. I suppose you want the same fate as Ruya. You stupid Egyptian. I'll teach you the same lesson she learned. Come! Try! Let's go, bud. You will pay, of course! <laughs> Come on then. Come on. In fact, in fact. Ah. 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 How did that taste? Hmm. The letter he mentioned. Dimnos cannot believe you have entered the service of Apollodorus. He serves the Egyptian woman in a country where women urinate standing up while men sit down. It is all backwards. Leave them and come join me in Cyrene. There are many fat merchants to fleece. Alcandros. Alrighty then. That was rather just like out of the fucking blue here. Was it Dimnos? Yes. Welcome he back, Lone Wolf. Out of base cruelty. And he died because he thought I was also less than a person. What a senseless tragedy. She was a smart girl with a good heart. Hey, a thousand XP, I don't care. Worked out great for me, sir. Oh, almost 18. Hey, wait, that actually works out really good, too, because gear-wise... I have hash and slash. I can finally use it. All in all, I think it's just a little bit worse. Oh, those things look sick.
Holy fuck yeah. Just mess people the fuck up. I like ye. I like ye. Alright. Basically at the road now. We need to follow down this road. Come here. What in the fuck is going on? Ha! There we go. 100 XP. It's not really all that much, but it was something. It almost put us over. Over the uh, the threshold. That'd have been really nice, but nope. No luck. Wow! Some people got fucked up here. It's a lot of blood, dude. What'd you do? And carry yourself without fear. Can you help a poor farmer? Your friend was killed by a hippo. Yes, the beast rampage slaughtered many. Yesterday, we were attacked by bandits. In their wake, they disturbed these hippos and drove them into our fields. The gods oh? came to peace on us. We so you want me to kill the hippos? hippos? Nor can we put the dead to rest with the hippos in our fields. Ah, uh, this is definitely one of those things I need, not need, but I really am going to want to do by horseback. I can feel that now. Horse or camelback, like, it's gotta be. Bring dead back to the cart. There's a hippo. What's up, bitch? Pink. Oh shit! Oh shit, they killed my horse! Oh, never mind. He's up. Come on, ah, uh, one more, ah. Uh. Thank you, Adrenaline. That was a tough fight. Hippos kind of ain't no joke. Those fuckers will fuck your day up. Uh-oh. Hey, oh shit, they laced that hippo. Good. Oh my god, seriously? I can't help you guys again. I'm sorry. I've got other things I need to do right now. One, two, three, at least. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Get out. Motherfucker. Motherfucker. Gonna have to fight ya. Come on. 
come on. No. There we go. Ah, motherfucker. Those things are tough. Hey, what up, though? Since this is my friend, I am doing Wolfenstein, so all kinds of soon change. So please forgive me. What? Oh, yeah, that's right. You have been here before. That makes sense. And yes, yes, my buddy Pendle Pants. He actually hasn't been on in the last couple of days very much. He's got so much shit happening in his fucking life right now, it's kind of ridiculous. But yeah, no. No, not him. I would help you. I, I, I am no match for those beasts. Good, uh, what the hell? Japanese, yeah. Pretty sure, anyways. Is this Maketra? Not this. This is my wife's brother's son. He was a fool. Great. What do you. Mm. Pretty sure. Not a hundred percent, but pretty sure. Should be the last body with this guy. Running through the wheat fields, My carrying dead is bodies. He's, he's gone. There you go. Really? It didn't count it because I didn't put it in the right spot? Are you kidding me? There you go. The last one, I think. There you go. Their souls will now rest in peace. Or rest in the stomach of a alligator. Not sure. Brave and strong like you, he would chase away fierce animals or the bandits who plague us. I guess there's no. Depends on the game. Keep us safe. I mean, if a creepy, creepy doll asks me if I want to play a game, I might be inclined to say no. I would take you there, but it is. Especially on Halloween. Also, someone must deal with the dead. Of course, I will find it. The bandits are known as the Hungry Great Ones. May the gods protect you. Hmm. What will I do now? Canyon to the west. Let me just quickly see... Well, we're kind of heading in that direction anyways. I think I'm, my plan was kind of to grab this viewpoint and do a little bit of a loop around. Um, what's our next main quest? The hyena, the lizard's mask, and the crocodile scales. So, Bayek travels to Giza to meet the informant, informant Mairead to learn of his targets, the hyena. So yeah, we basically just kind of need to do a whole bunch of side quests here before we travel on to the next area is what we need to do now. Uh, learn more about the murderer. Hmm. Alright, let's go save this dumbass then. Oh, come on, man. You got caught. Why'd you get caught? Konnichiwa. Welcome to the stream and chat. How's it going for you today? Oh, shit. Of course, he just went backwards. Just about, anyways. And dismount. Alright, so... Hmm. I feel like we can still climb this one, though. Really? We should be able to climb this. Come on. There we go. Come on. There we go. Up. And up. And up. 
Synchronize. Fuck, this game is pretty. I gotta say, most of my Japanese is swear words I picked up from anime. As sad as it is. Is that three or is that two? That's two. Uh, well, I mean, that would get us buy materials and or tool kill XP. Could also get us, uh, hijack. I want to work my way up to chariots. I really want to get chariots. Is this one ability point? I don't think I can go this way for one. Hmm. Let's get hijack. Hijack seems good. Hijack seems like a skill we'll definitely end up using. There we go. Oh, and hey, it looks like we've got some more crafting things. Possibly... Nope, we haven't gotten this yet. Where is it? Health. Seven, nine... Nah, but we can still do a bracer upgrade. It's certainly not going to hurt us to do a bit of a bracer upgrade, and we have more than enough materials right now. Couple more regular pelts, and we will be good to do our next health upgrade as well. Alright. Let's take a quick look with Senu proper status. Treasure. At least four of them standing in a corner there. Do I have any fire? I do. Gotta get used to how the uh, the light double fucking blades work in combat. Oh, oh damn though, that flurry combo. best for guards. I'm not gonna lie. I mean, he just... Like, I had my guard up, and he seemed to have chopped through it without actually needing, like, a guard buster. So that's a little bit concerning. This is my first kind of real, true, hardcore... Well, I won't say hardcore, but like, actual attempt at using these things in combat. They do tend to chop through people really well, though. They work pretty good. I don't know, I just... Uh, I don't know. I'm, I'm gonna keep working with it for a little bit, see if I enjoy it. Probably won't be using those that much, though. From the way they feel right now and shit. Yeah. How's it going, sir? You're free. Get up. Hurry. These bandits bleed like rats. Where? 
Come on, dodge. Help! Come, Come on, man. Oh, I even dodged towards him. Got a problem here. There we go, finally. Yeah, I don't know, it's not my favorite weapon. What in the hell is he aiming at? Fucking hold still, Jesus. Alright, taken out. Let me check up on the chat. Well, peace out, have a good one. Thanks for popping in while you could, and we'll talk to you later. The overpower close distance he runs in. And when you overpower combo, they shank the shit out of enemies. Nice. Yeah, it seems like they'd be fun for, like, execution kills and shit. I just don't know how fun they're gonna be in terms of actual strength and, and penetrating power. Oh, never mind. We're supposed to speak to him. Thank you. But why did you save me? Because I was asked Euron to. Euron spoke of your desperate straits. I would free any unjust captive, but the plight of a protector is something I cannot ignore. You are a Medjai. We are of the same brotherhood. Yes, I must hurry home. The watch huh. Fat Homer took the hungry great ones on a raid. You move like a lion. Would you help me stop them? God damn it. Move! Alright, next objective. Anyways, uh, thanks for the tip, Chairman. I'll keep an eye open for it. I do plan to try and do all the side quests and shit that I can find. And that aren't just ridiculous or, like, stupid collecty or some shit like that. But yeah, I plan to do as much in this game as possible. So you don't have to worry too much about whether or not I'll find it. Matter of when is definitely up in the air. Fucking around with civvies? No. Come on then, bitch. Wow, he hits so fucking fast with such a big weapon. I kind of want it. Wow! There. Fuck your day. Come on. There we go. Oh, what? Are you... Now we gotta fight these guys, too? Or no, I guess not. They just showed up. They're also being dickheads, though. So, basically... There we go. There's one. Oh! Fuck this camera. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 
Hey, wait, how do I unhorse? It didn't actually say. Is it triangle, I bet? Ah. Uh. Let's see. One left. Oh. Hmm. Because I definitely have the unhorse skill now. I'm just not sure why I'm not getting a prompt. I don't know what it is. It didn't tell me in the thing either. What up, though, gangster? Welcome to the stream and chat, sir. How's it going for you today, man? Just give me a second here. Ah, come on. Fine. You wanna play that way? God damn it. Come on, bitch. Ah, get knocked the fuck off. I uh, only speak English, bro, but, uh... You're still welcome no matter what, man. <laughs> hey, you know what? I really like the multiculturalism. I do. That's one thing that's got to be said. All in all, not a bad channel that way. It's not like it's all one country or anything like that. Come on. Oh, oh. Ah, dead hippo. Ah, and German turtle's alive. He may be joining in the party here shortly. Probably will be, actually. Alright, we still need to speak to this guy about the fact that we just cleared out his village for him. Because he's kind of useless. Uh-oh. 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 Uh... Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Uh-oh. Uh Those guys are level 22, too. I need to get the fuck out. I need to get the fuck out. I need to get the fuck out. I'm fine with killing them, but not when they're that much higher than me. Motherfuckers. Maketra, I think we are done. You fought like a lion yourself. I have learned much from you. You've made one me second here, bro. Egypt needs more people like you. The land needs more people like us. I will sing songs of our battle to my aunt to remember this day. Yeah, no, as it stands. As it stands, I uh, I don't play FIFA. I'm not a big soccer fan. And video games can kind of make it more interesting to me, but FIFA just hasn't really brought me in yet. I played Football Manager and stuff like that because I do like management and tactics games and stuff like that. But I don't know if I'd do a Let's Play of that just because it's... I mean, I already know that it would be kind of boring. You know, like it's fun for me to play, but it's a really niche market. That being said, though, thanks for the suggestion, and I will take it to heart in a sense. And, uh, if they make one that interests me, I'll definitely try to play it for you. Tis interesting you live in Moscow, though. I live in Canada, so I've... We're, we're both probably going through the same type of shit right now. Winter is coming, and it's getting fucking colder. You probably have it worse than I do, though, which is not something most people can say. There we go. Fuck that guy's statue. <sighs> so, we've carved a couple of swaths out of the mini missions that are on the way there, essentially. We've got, in protest over here, we've got a couple of side quests over here. So what? One, two, three, four, five side quests basically left in the area? How far before they start to appear? There we go. And as long as we can get those ones done... Oh, and then we've got three more up here that were just too high of a level before. But we should be doing... We should be good by the time we get over there. So yeah, my thought is... is By the time we're done with all these quests, we should be in a good position to go to Giza. And if we're not going straight to actual Giza, which is fine. It's alright. 
Um, we will be, you know, stopping at the regions that we pass through and seeing various things on the way. That's my plan, anyways. Viper's Tooth. Nice! Yeah, what did I get today, Fig Jam? I got, uh... Sea People's Blade. For a level 17 to have 177 DPS is pretty good. And actually, I'm going to be swapping back to that, because I like having a shield. I don't mind hash and slash, but yeah. I also got this, uh, this shield from him, I believe. This one, which has sleep on block. Sometimes when you block, they fall asleep. And that's fucking gangster. Pardon, Neb. I cannot sell any chariots today. My Serapis. I cannot believe my eyes. That looks like a Medjai badge. How can you tell? I'm not even wearing it in this suit. <laughs> Sorry, dude. Wrong button. Please forgive <laughs> me. For a moment, I thought you were the sign of the Medjai, the lost protectors. I do. I am. What pains you, Nebeth? My heart is broken. My truest friend, my husband, Eriks, has been murdered. Tell me what happened. He was renowned for his work. A soldier ordered him to build war chariots for the Pharaoh. He was happy to do so. But when the soldier returned to collect, he only offered to pay half the agreed price. Eriks refused, and the soldier cut him down and stole the chariot. Damn! If you are truly a Medjai. Will you help me get justice? Find the soldier and destroy the war chariot so he may not insult my husband's memory. Yeah, I guess. I we only have three. I do only have three. I like that. If you look, how many arrows you have legitimately displays on your back. Two, three, two, three, two, three. That is fucking awesome. I love that. What about if I do that? Alright, so it doesn't show how many bombs I have left. That's fine, though. That makes sense. There's been a tragic accident in the lumber station just along the shoreline. Nefermat and his crew were slaughtered by a group of territorial hippos. Whoever can rid us of these bloated river crow cows is welcome to any valuables left behind. Be warned that the site is not for gentle eyes. Shit, I should have checked the location for more shit, actually. That would have been a smart thing to do. Um, but I didn't, because I'm kind of a doorknob sometimes, and I've forgotten about loot in this game. Which I should really be collecting. Really be collecting. Let's grab this thing, and... Uh, I mean, I'm gonna end up having to come back here, I think, but I may as well grab it while I'm here. Also, there is a blacksmith here. Let us go see what he is offering. Wait, what? Oh. How can I help you? Um. Hassanlu Skeptron. Mute bow, copper arc, metal shield. Not a whole fuck of a lot. Where, where is the treasure? I kind of like that idea as well. I'm gonna try, yeah. On my way to do my next mission, my next main objective, in a sense, is going to be to, um. Damn it. Yeah. Figures. Let's see. If I fly over to here, to like the center of this. Hmm. I'm just, I'm not sure, because it does say that there's two treasures here. Shit. Come here. Damn it. Pussies. Tired of living, hot son. 
Come on then. Whoa! Oh! Shot in the back, son of a bitch. I got one of those shields from a scroll treasure, I think. One of the captains in this fort has a leg, too. A, le a legendary item. <laughs> oh, that's great. I don't know if you would have the same legendary item. I don't know if it'd be the same at all. It might not be. Don't cry for these mouthy peasants. No, I was just saying. You'll think his widow is still running that shop. Really? And once again, just give me a second here. Because this is driving me fucking nuts. What do I do? Pull enemy drivers off their mount and take control of it. But it does not tell you how in the fuck you do that. That bugs me a little bit. Options. Controls. Primary interact assassinate. Lock, secondary... I have no fucking idea and it's driving me up the wall. What the fuck is the point in having a skill you can't use? I'll rally the troops! I mean, the sneaky route did not work again, but that's okay. That's okay. Wait, do you fancy her? Do you shot all the women? There you go. Freedom. Lots of roads behind me. I will get Oh! Motherfucker. There we go. Pull people off mounts if you're in combat with them, it's kind of pointless. Uh, it's not pointless if you're on the ground and they're not, man. Being able to swap out is great. But yeah, once again, I just, I really dislike the fact that it's not giving me any type of, uh, info thing on it. Like, how do I accomplish said feat? Not going anywhere. Okay. 
What the fuck? Hey. Ooh. Hello. What? Motherfucker. Of course I'm out of ammo. Wow! Alarm! Over here! Help! I got trouble here! Come on! God damn it! I ain't got time for you guys' shit. Finally, Jesus Christ. Combat in this game is, uh, it's tricky to get mastered. It, it's not too hard to learn, it is very Lock tricky to master. To wow. I think I def Oh no, I see the arrow in me. It looked kind of like I deflected it, I was like, what? Yeah, like I'm holding triangle, I'm, I don't know what to do. So the next part of the quest is in fact nearby, but it's just like, like I said, I'm really confused as to how the fuck to bring somebody off the mount, because they haven't explained any of that. Fine. You want to play that way? Fuck you, sir. Oh my god. The reinforcements thing sucks. It sucks, dick. There's the war chariot. Oh my fucking god. Wait, I have a great idea on how I can destroy this, though. Let's see. Quickly swap from this bow over to a Pitamak. Fuck off already. Come on, get the... There you go. 
Of course they are. Of course they are. What is happening here? Ah, driving me a little bit nuts right now. There we go. It is done. The sacrifice made to honor the builder who was cut down. Speak to Europa. Dodge attack is real. Yeah, the point of most Assassin's Creed's game is to do everything stealth. This game seems much, much less stealth. You can still do it as a stealth game, but it is not designed to be a stealth game when your primary weapons can... are, you know, heavy weapons where you're smashing people, you have escort missions where you have to fight people, they're not stealth related. There's, there's definitely a lot less of a stealth aspect ingrained in this game versus some of the previous. Oh, for fuck. It'd be awesome if that guy could piss off. Where is he, anyways? Hmm. Alright, well, we should be good now. Honorable Medjai, what news do you bring? I have destroyed the war chariot that Eric's made and was stolen by the vile captain of Antilla. Your husband's memory is restored. Well, you have dismounted them. Yeah, by hitting them, unfortunately, though. Yeah, yeah, no, the, this game, like, for a game that's so vastly different from any Assassin's Creed game that's ever come before it, they do absolutely nothing in the way of holding your fucking hand. I hate, like, ah, uh, it's, that's another one of the things of the game industry that's kind of bugged me lately. You know, like, we started saying, hey, we don't need you to hold our hand the whole fucking game, give us some tutorials, teach us some shit, and then let us go our own way. Game companies took that and were like, oh, they don't want tutorials? Oh, okay. And then just, like, removed the entire idea of a tutorial from a fucking game. You get, like, three minutes of tutorial, and then boom, the rest of the game you're just getting shafted because you don't know what the fuck to do can't read the game now like the manual anymore because they don't make them <laughs> gotta go online and find it dig it out of a fucking archive somewhere I was gonna say this is a new location very different looking kind of setup surrounded by water all over the fucking place not where I would personally live but you know how's it going lady the tanner is my husband. He carries that stench home whenever he returns from camp. Is he here now? By the smell, you would think so. But it's worse when he's around. Do not let it trouble you. We all must do work we do not relish. You are right. My husband works hard, but cannot keep up with the demand for his services. The Medjai are said to be legendary hunters. If you would like to earn some good coin, go and see him. I'm sure he could use your help. Some good coin, huh? I will consider it. Where would I find him? His hunting camp is north and west of Sao. Of Sao. You will Thick be skin. hides for a few days. If Did you ever see work as fine as Onirisis? Serpent of 
Serapis Ostracon. Serapis, husband of Iset, god of the dead, who just dipped the spear in the Nile to make it light and true. Serapis, who watched over a dying king, who sharpened this blade on the edge of night to make it ever sharp. Tool, I name you the Serpent of Serapis and dedicate you to the gods. Ah, the Serpent of Serapis. You have heard the tragic tale? Not the whole of it. Oh, it was a true masterpiece. The shaft. Wrapped with water-hardened leather, the blade hammered out of the metal of heaven. I would love to see it. Impossible. I crafted it for one of Apollodorus's captains when I lived in Saïs. But Sefeto's soldiers killed him. That is the reason I left. Sefeto? Yes, Sefeto the Firebrand, who covers Saïs with flame and fear. One of his bootlickers stole the spear that bears my mark. Outrageous. Can you not get it back? The man is beyond my reach. He sails on one of Sepetu's triremes on Mariatus Lake. Ah, I hate a bully. My travels take me far and wide. If I come across him, I will look for your spear. Fuck yeah. I would yeah. love nothing more than to hear of his fall. If you manage it, the Serpent of Serapis is yours. Awesome. Sounds like a really good weapon. Hello, I'd still like to interact with you though because you might have new shit. Iron Spear, Wolf's Bane, Achilles Heel Seeker, and a Worn Shield. Not really. Bring it up to level 18 for 750. So this is one thing that I kind of don't like about this game um, that I'll point out too. It is grindy. Like if you want to keep your shit competitive, you gotta make a lot. And I mean a lot of fucking money. Here's the other thing I'll point out too. The fact that it's the exact same price to raise all three of these weapons up to the maximum level kinda sucks. You know what I mean? Like, it's. Uh, it's a kick in the dick. It's a kick in the dick. Bladed Scepter. Acacia Rod. See? Bringing that up to 18 would cost me 3900 Like, so ridiculous. I hope we make more money later, because otherwise I'm going to have to do a lot of fucking races off camera to buy the shit that I want and raise our shit up the way that I want it to be raised. Oh, uh, before we go, though, let's interact. Refill our arrows and our tools. It's going to cost us a little bit of money, and we could have refilled off something else, but fuck it, I'll take it. At least now we don't have to hunt for a uh, archery rack or whatever the hell. All right, well, peace out, Lone Wolf. Thanks for popping in while you could, sir. I appreciate it, and we will see you next time, man. And yeah, the the lack of fucking instruction manuals is just ridiculous. Wolfenstein. Hey, I do want to play Wolfenstein too, but I also want to look at the reviews a little bit more closely. I've been told by a friend that it's really short, and I don't like that idea. I feel like that's a slap in the face of the true fans, you know? Like, it's a kind of a slap in the face of the consumer. If you're gonna charge full price for a game, make it last a little while. Don't make it fucking snap of the finger and it's done. Um, I'm pretty sure that blue one is a vendetta type mission or whatever. Hmm. So we still have one, two, at least three, four, five more missions to pick up, let alone to do. How is our side quest list thing looking? How's our main quest thing looking? The Hyena, we are now within range to do that. The Scarab Sting. Bayek travels to Saez to meet the informant. Hark Huff to learn of one of his targets, the Scarab. It's a level 15 recommendation. It is only 400 meters away. Damn. We do still have five more side quests to complete. One of which is way too high for us to do. Oh, the vault, right. Okay, fair enough. Alright, so, that being said, though, we are coming up on the two-hour mark here. I started at four, it's just about six. So, we are going to end this stream here. I hope you guys have enjoyed this stream, this episode, this series as a whole. I apologize for the commentary being a little bit lackluster today. Um, I am incredibly tired. That being said, though, I'm going to go make myself a double cup of coffee. Big, fat, fucking tall one. 
And if I'm feeling up to it, we'll be back with another episode of Assassin's Creed Origins. I am going to put one more day worth of hold on War of the Chosen, but that is going to be coming back to the channel. If you want a character featured in the War of the Chosen Season 2 playthrough when I do actually get around to doing that, which will be an edited series, uh, go check out Episode 0 of XCOM 2's War of the Chosen. It has all the various customization options there and a character sheet that you can customize and create and mix and match and create your own character in. And yeah, if you've enjoyed this episode and all of that stuff, do me that solid. Hit the like button, leave a comment, thoughts, critiques, criticisms, what kind of games you'd like to see featured on the channel, and how you found the channel in the first place. Leave a sub if you haven't already, a follow if you're watching on the PlayStation, and as always, hit that share button to help spread the word of Kush Coffee and games so we can continue to grow the community as a whole. Thanks for watching, and the blue mission isn't Vendetta, it's a Rita mission. Do it, good gear. Vendetta has a skull, Rita has an exclamation point. Uh, I found that a lot of these ones are actually the Vendetta missions. Oh, it is a Rita mission. What the fuck? How did I get two? That doesn't make sense. I've already done one today. You're only supposed to get one a day. What the fuck? Well, I'm definitely gonna go do that afterwards. Um, this one, this Vendetta mission or whatever will be either done in the next episode or off camera. Once again, thank you guys for joining me and peace out. I will see you either in two hours or tomorrow night.